Hello everyone, this is Arkady from Joy T5. Today, we're going to continue our series of lift test videos and we got our 6.2 ton GT5600 excavator and we'll see how much it can lift. The reason for doing this lift test videos is that uh, quite often the actual performance of the machine uh, differs from the theoretical one that you can find on spec sheets. Uh, also, we want to demonstrate that the lifting capacities will be different depending on how far away are you from the base of the machine. Do you have your blades down or up? Are you lifting over the sides? And the easiest way to answer how much can a machine lift is to actually watch our videos. The way the lift test is going to be performed is by tying a crane scale that you see over there to an anchor that is buried in the ground and connecting the top part to the tooth of the bucket. When you're going to pull on the crane scale with the excavator, it will show us what is the lifting force. At JT5, we want our customers to be informed about what type of performance they can expect. That is why we will perform these tests at the multiple distances away. Uh, hopefully, it will give you a good understanding. And now, let's begin. The first test is going to be done with approximately 9 feet away between the edge of the blade and the anchor point. Uh, please keep in mind that this specific machine has a tilt blade, which might be a different dimension than a fixed blade. Since it's a diesel machine, first we need to glow plug it. We turn the key to the left and hold it for five seconds. Okay, now we're able to turn the key to the right and start it. All right, the machine is started. We'll give it about half throttle. We'll lift our hydraulic block and uh, let's start the lift. Hey, that's about it. With nine feet away from the edge of the blade to the anchor point, we're able to lift and hold about 4,800 pounds. We are still at the same position, but we lifted the blade. And now let's see what's the difference going to be with the blade up. Hey, the rear of the machine already lifted. We moved the machine closer by three feet to the anchor. So right now we're six feet away from the uh, anchor to the blade edge. And let's see how much we can lift now. That's as much as it's gonna go. Next test is six feet away from the blade with the blade up. Hey, the rear of the machine is up. For this test, we reposition the machine. We are three feet away from the edge of the blade till the anchor. Uh, we put a wooden blocks underneath the tracks because just the ground here has a slope down towards the anchor. And uh, right now, with the wooden block, the tracks of the machines are level. Uh, and we're going to do our first test with a blade up. The reason for it is that uh, our chain is rated for around 6,600 pounds. Uh, and in the previous uh, test, we were going already about it. So in order to avoid breaking the chain right away, we're going to do the first test with a blade up. The rear of the machine is up. Now we're lower the blade. We're three feet away from the edge of the blade. And at this position, we can expect to have the maximum lifting capacity of this machine. Hey, 
that's about the maximum. As you saw, was three feet away from the edge of the blade. The maximum lifting capacity we can get was about 8,500 pounds. Right now, we're going to turn the machine and we'll try to see what the tipping capacity is going to be over the side of the tracks. We are about 12 feet away from the anchor point till the edge of the track right here. The rear of the machine is up. Now we're five feet away from the anchor to the edge of the track right here. Hey, the area of the machine is up. As you saw in a series of our tests, the question how much can a machine lift is very low to the one. For JT5, GT5600, 6.2 ton excavator, the lifting capacity ranges from about 1,000 pounds to over 8,500 pounds. And it depends on how you're doing the lift. Are you doing it over the side or over the blade? How far away are you from the uh, lifting point? If you like this video and you want to see more, please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. It will be a clear message to us that uh, we should continue doing it. In the future, we plan to do this similar test uh, uh, videos with the wheel loaders, uh, three and a half ton excavators, uh, skid steers, and all the equipment that we'll be receiving. So if you're going to have any more questions about our machines, please visit joyt5.com or call one of our dealers. Thank you for watching.